Hello everyone. So today I was uh, playing with Confluence and I thought I'll probably show you a few things because you might want to uh, learn about those things if you're using uh, Confluence. And uh, what I will do is of course uh, I will create uh, a page and when I create a page I will basically use uh, a table and uh, based on that particular table I will also create some simple reports. Now Confluence is, is probably after Jira is probably like one of the mm, if not the most liked but at the same time because Confluence works really well with Jira usually when people have Jira in their organization not always but usually they also have Confluence and people use Confluence. Confluence is nice to is a nice tool and the only reason I like it is because it talks to Jira very nicely and smoothly. Now let us say you want to create a page right and on that particular page let us first define the requirement now the requirement is that we have to create a page where uh, we need to maybe present something or maybe we are doing some quick quick analysis now in conference you can of course have tables so let me first create a page then i'll create a table and then i'll i'll also show you how we can quickly very quickly create like some simple charts from it and this is something that you can do very quickly very easily like within minutes if not seconds so let us say we want to present this page like statistics and uh, statistics based on or maybe statistics employee statistics right let, let us say employee and when you are working on this uh, statistics uh, you know page because it is a page you may want to make it a bit more useful like uh, or not really useful a bit more beautiful I guess. So let us use uh, this nice uh, image of uh, maybe maybe this uh, plant right on top. So this looks good and uh, in Confluence you can also now easily create these uh, statuses. Basically let us say this is uh, in progress right. So I'll add this here on top so that uh, I can see uh, or whenever someone is looking at it they can just review and uh, make a decision based on this or maybe just you know review the information before you publish it or be before you share it with everyone. Now let us say you want to add some content. Now this is where of course you will start typing this uh, on this page you will find some simple stats or statistics. Now what you can do is uh, to insert a new macro if you're on Jira Cloud not on the server uh, data center you can press uh, this, uh, I keep pressing the wrong, you know, I, I keep pressing this backslash, uh, press forward slash and you will be presented with this, you know, list. Here you will find this option called table. Now what you can also do because some of these macros can be inserted very easily without uh, doing much. You can simply press these uh, shortcuts. For a, for a table it is shift alt t. Uh, so if I press shift alt t, it will insert a table right now let us say i want to insert a table with uh, maybe three columns you can of course change it so let us say name what else maybe age region a simple example let us say i'll type in my name my my age is of course 21 uh, and i live in delhi then uh, i'll add vinod vinod lives in uh, i guess uh, Noida, but no, he's from Delhi. Uh, so maybe someone else like Manoj, 23. Manoj lives in Noida, and maybe maybe Anish. Anish is uh, also 22 years, or maybe 20, maybe 22. Okay, and Anish is from Mumbai. So we have this table now. Good thing is that you can also maybe you you have to create some stats or maybe the stats are there already and you want to now report on it. So what you can also do, you can actually click on this option here called chart, and you can actually then. Uh, oh, by the way, there are some options for uh, you know table. Uh, we are not really interested in that. Just click on it, and uh, it will simply create a chart for you. Amazing! Like like uh, this is something that is. Uh, of course useful but at the same time uh, you may want to uh, modify it so good thing is that this chart and while you're editing it this is live so maybe i'll just uh, reduce the size and show you so if i if you modify the age of anish 27 you can see that this is uh, 
changing on the fly and this is of course interesting so let us change it back to 24 or uh, maybe i'll change my age to maybe 25 so so that we can see some variation and uh, of course we may want to modify something in this chart maybe you want to create uh, if not a bar chart maybe you want to create a pie chart so you can also do that and uh, this is of course again uh, if you modify something here this will change so this is of course very simple that you can do and it is just an example but uh, you can uh, use it for uh, doing a lot of wonderful things like uh, because i know a lot of people they as part of their responsibility they have to present some quick stats or maybe daily stats or whatever whatever stats and this data can be of course you know i mean don't worry about i'm, I'm not really bothered about the actual data from where it is coming but it can be some data right and you can then uh, create a report out of it and that's some th that is something that you can do very quickly and easily and lately i, I i've seen a lot of updates in confluence and uh, uh, i don't massively use uh, confluence I, i've mentioned this many times but if i look at the because i try to of course uh, when i make videos i look at the stats and whenever i have made a video on confluence I've, I've received good views so I, I think people are interested so maybe i should listen to them and uh, make more videos on confluence so do let me know if you want because i although i don't really use it myself but i do work on it and i do a lot of wonderful things with confluence because you know first of all it is connected with jira like natively but at the same time because confluence also comes with rest api i think i've i think i've made few videos on confluence rest api all right that is it that is it for today's video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new thank you very much